day opener. They're in the gate. And they're off. With a mile and a sixteenth ahead of them, Susie's gal to the outside takes the early advantage. Siriana's song against the inside rail, and they are going a dawdling early gallop. No more than a canter here as they go now towards the final seven-eighths of a mile. The one who was just taken off heels through the early going was handcrafted, had to be snatched back, and got a troubled run into the clubhouse turn. But it is on the sharp end, Susie's gal who leads the way. Meandering to the back stretch they go. The first quarter in 26 seconds flat. Three quarters of a mile out. And it's Susie's gal who leads the way by three quarters of a length. Luna Vega to the outside is racing in second. Satin Thunder is in third. Siriana's song, the inside rail, is in fourth position. Handcrafted now makes a move four wide down the back stretch. Just the back marker is Uno Peso as they go through the halfway point and go now towards the end of the back stretch with Susie's gal and Julien Leperou still out in front through a very, very slow half mile of 51 and 1. So they leave the back stretch behind them. They're still very tightly grouped. This will develop into a dash for the cash. Susie's girl is out in front, leads now by a neck to the outside. Luna Vega is there in second. Satin Thunder is in third and now asked to get a little bit closer by Robbie Alvarado. Pushed along on the inside. That is Siriana's song who's now in fourth position. In fifth is Uno Peso about to take fourth. The back marker handcrafted. Phillies and mares come down this famous stretch. Susie's gal still has the lead but now Luna Vega sweeps to the advantage. Luna Vega and Sean Bridgmahan now go for home inside the final furlong. Luna Luna Vega out in front now by two and a half lengths to Susie's gal in second. The rest don't count today. Racing up towards the line, it is Luna Vega in front. Luna Vega wins the Oaks Day opener in second Susie's gal and in third Satin Thunder.